Hey guys, that Financial Gamer here. So, I'm just gonna do a review or install, whatever. I don't know what you call it, but um, I just got this Con Kanba, Kanba, whatever, Kanba, Kanba. I don't know what it's called. Kanba? Uh, Gravity Silent Joystick. Um, I've heard a couple, you know, reviews about this joystick. Um, you know, just try to find something different versus your Sanwa. As you can see, this is my Obsidian 1, Kwanba. Obsidian 1, um, pretty good stick, you know. I know there's Obsidian 2, but I'm not going to waste my money. If it's still a functional stick, you know, I'm going to use it. And I play on PC, so I don't need the PS5 features. Even though this is for PS4. Um, so this is considered for PS4, PS3, PC. I think this was released around 2018, but... Um, 2017, 20, I don't know, but yeah, so I'm not gonna fuck, um, put out $300 or so on the Kwanba 2 for PS5 because I don't even play PS5 fighting games, you know, all my fighting games are on PC, so don't need it. But, um, I do want to try another stick though because these are just a regular Sanwa JLFs, as you can see, Square Gate. And sound wall buttons. And I was curious about this one. This is the Kwanba Gravity Silent Joystick. So this is Kwanba's proprietary joystick. I don't know if it's proprietary, but it's mechanical shaft switch. You know, mechanical, like if you think about a mechanical keyboard, you know. So um, I didn't like the packaging though. I got it from Amazon. As you see, there's bent here. So it comes in a tin can and is bent here, so I'm gonna ding that. Um, but anyways, everything looks good. This is what it comes with. So you get the ball top here, which looks cool. It's like a bowling ball. Um, I still like the red though. Is it the same? I think it's about the same. A little heavy. Looks cool. So something changed. I do like the red though, red and black, but since I'm going to use this, I'll just use this. Okay. And then you get a couple spring. I don't know what the spring is for. Medium. Oh, it's me elasticity. So you put the spring on here to, I guess, um, get the elasticity. So you get heavy spring. And you get a medium spring. So I think I might go with the heavy one. You know? Or I don't know. With Tekken, with Street Fighter, you want it just very, very loose. So I think I'll go with the medium one. Um, you get a couple gates here. So it comes. So here's the joystick, guys. Sorry about that. Um, let me pull this out. Here it is, guys. Um, let, me, let me just show you what's everything. So you get the joystick, a couple gates, which is the oct octagonal, octagonal, octagonal gate right there. I think this is good for 3D fighters, Tekken. And you got the circle gate. Who uses this? Like, probably for Pac-Man or like old school arcade style games. Fighting games though, good luck if you're going to use this. And it comes by default, your regular square gate. So, and it comes with a couple um, cables to attach to the motherboard. And pretty much that's it guys. Let's put the tin can out of the way. So, that's what it comes everything with. Cost me about 45 bucks on Amazon. So, let's see. Um, I'm not going to do an install video because that's too long. But I'm just going to show you the before and after. So, again, this is the JLF, as you can see. It makes noises. And this is the Conva. No noise.
so there it is guys um let's go install this and then i'll get back to the video right okay guys so i opened it up so it looks like that right there so that's our our jlf right there and i'm just gonna be unscrewing that and putting that in there looks like it'll fit let's see so as you can see here's the thing that goes there you got the little brackets screw the brackets in you got the cable there the cable right there and basic perfect fit so and again take care of your fight sticks guys um i'm just gonna kind of dust it off So, again, take care of fights, guys, so you don't have to buy another one. And then, yeah, let's install it, and then I'll get back at you. All right. And there it is, guys. It just fit like a glove, so it's perfect. I like how uh, Conba basically, well, it's, it's a Conba product, so you most likely it will fit in a Conba stick. So, which has made the installation much easier. So... And again, if you want to replace the the gate, there's all you have to do is unscrew those, and then you could put the different styles of gate. All of this, you just have to just screw and basically screw them on. That's it. But I'm sticking to my square gate. So, all right, let's just uh, finish up. And looks like uh, it came with brand new cable, so I'll just replace this old one with this new one here. You know. Maybe um, the input lag will improve. I don't know. New cables, better input. Makes sense, right? Okay. All right, guys. There it is, guys. So everything's all put it put back in place. Cleaned it a little bit. Looks pretty brand new. So again, guys. Um, only thing I have I hate about the stick is this little lever here it broke. But it's a pretty good stick, you know. And now I got a silent lever. It's not really silent, but you know, so you can hear. It's more silent than the JLFs. As you can see here. How it makes clicky noises. Click 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 click. So still got the sound wall buttons. But I might consider getting the silent buttons. Conva also sells silent buttons. But I'm gonna think about it because you know when you're pressing buttons versus joystick, joystick is okay. It's the buttons, these ones, that you want some kind of cue when you do your combos and stuff. It's kind of like piano. You know, you want to sound a little bit so you get sound cues to press the button so you know what buttons to press. But the joystick, you don't really need cues because it's just motion. So, but yeah, let's go test it out, guys. But yeah, that's it. Um, here's the ball top. Oh, uh, looks pretty cool, you know. Um, you do have the red one though. Red one pops though, but this one looks pretty cool. So I don't know, but again, you can always switch it. And this is the same, you could actually switch it. The threads and stuff are the same. So if you want to do, put different color ball tops and you could also put the bat top too. So, but I think this one's more higher quality than this one. This one's a Sandwall one. I think this one's more higher quality. So, all right guys, let's go test it out. All right guys, so. Here it is, and there's Street Fighter 6. So let's do some movement.
Alright, and let's look at the response time. So I'm going to move it. Up, down, forward. So it looks pretty good, guys. Look. Because again, when the joystick, when you move it, it goes back to neutral. Because it's just natural. There's, there's a spring in there that when you move it and you let go, neutral. So I'm barely moving it and it goes back to neutral. So it's pretty calibrated and pretty good response. There's a diagonal. See, so diagonal, neutral. Down. So I'm already feeling it, guys. It's it's much better response time because it has Omron mechanical switches. So think of Omron has like the cat like this one here. This is Omron. This is mechanical keyboard. So you get a better response time, guys. So um, yeah, I'm liking it, guys. I'm really liking it. And as you can see, hardly any sound. So when I'm doing um, Dragon Dragon Punch or Hadouken, SPD, and so as you can see, this is the sound from the mechanical Omron switches from the Kanba, and this is the. See, look at the sound difference, guys. So, yeah, guys. Um, it's really responsive. I'm liking it. I'm liking it. So, I'm just going to test it out in a few online matches. And then, um, um, I'll upload those videos. But, there it is, guys. Again, this is the Kanba. Gravity. Here it is, guys. Hold on. Let me get the tin. Again. There it is, guys. Kanba Gravity Silent Joystick with the mechanical shaft switches and this is the JOVAS model. There's three models of this and this one is uh, the Omron mechanical switch models with the custom springs. So you put these springs, I didn't put them on because you know I don't care about elasticity or whatever but you can actually customize this like see how it's so like that if you want it to be more hard like with more give then you can put these springs on and it can be a little harder you know depends on what game or what your style is is but i guess it helps with you know controlling but i didn't put them on so then didn't care but it's it's cool though that they add that to customize the stick even further but all right guys um yeah uh leave a comment below on the kanba or what do you think do you have this joystick and would you care what do you think better than the jlf um but you know trying something different again kanba is like the new mad cats of the fighting game community so i'm liking their products and um, yeah, if you have the stick, leave a comment below. And what do you guys think of the stick, guys? What do you think about the silent feature, you know? Um, yeah, and if you have any questions, leave the questions below and I'll answer them as soon as possible. And yeah, so there it is, guys. is the Kanba Gravity Silent Joystick. All right, don't forget to like and subscribe, guys. All right, thanks.